Alex with you guys to China Sport Big Dog back with another one take review. My bad. Oh, there we go. Uh, today I got one for Fire Force Season 2, Episode 23. And this episode pretty much focused on a lot of stuff we had been meaning and needing to see. One was the stuff with the. Uh, we had to see what was going on with Conroe. You know what I'm saying? Like, hey, how did you, you know, you had some uh, some dealings with the Dola? And, and, and she will obviously go to like ask him about it because he pretty much trusts Conroe. Like, I don't think he would do anything like that. But he's accompanied by Princess Ivana. I just got to, sh I, uh, she repulls, she rep like, you got Princess Ibana right there in your face, what is you doing, don't nobody want sister, get no, no, don't nobody want sister, don't nobody care about Tomiki, even though, hey, Tomiki not, not a, not a bad pick, but I'm just saying, bro, also, we see him getting attacked by the white clad, which I don't, I still don't fully understand why they attacked him because like that was that was a thing he, he had known they been he had known they had been uh, uh, following him for a while. He was able to like eliminate him pretty easily, but that's that's like the difference between the level of uh, like the lieutenant and, and, and the captains and stuff like that. They they're pretty much those uh those underlings really don't stand a chance against those guys are ranked that high. Um, but like Shinra and Princess Bond are pretty much like not interrogating, but they ask him a question like, hey, what's going on? He like. When he first fought in that uh, in that battle, how was it? Two years ago, four years ago? How many years ago it was? He was like, "Hey, this this is what happened." Like the um, the inferno that he saw that time was like a carbon copy of himself. So now we are looking up doppelgang doppelgangers. I thought a doppelganger is somebody who looks like you. You know what I'm saying? I didn't think it was like to to that extent. You know what I'm saying? Especially, especially the fact that the person in front of and like. They, his move, their move set was the exact same. So I'm, I'm, I'm they're gonna pretty much find some more stuff about that later on. Um, another thing is, um, Shinra is a, uh, hey, he realized like, hey, I'm, I'm strong, but like these people I'm facing right now, you know, they, 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 they strong, okay. And he ends up talking to Benamaro, Benamaro, like, hey, it's, it's okay, it's time for you, like your next level of training. And so Shiva goes back there against Arthur, and not on, not on, uh, only does uh, Arthur come along, it's Tomiki. And Tomiki is training with the kids. They're like, hey, uh, run away from them for 60 seconds, okay? One minute, you know what I'm saying? That's all you have to do, and then, you know, you'll be ready to be trained. And this was, weak. okay, this is where it could have went bad, but, like, the way the show works, it, it, it made sense to me. You know what I'm saying? Because Tomiki... I mean, I think we all know, like, after the battle and another, we knew she needed to get stronger. But we just like, what, what, what else is she going to do? And then we see these two little girls who are able to catch her. They're like, really no problem. But then we also get to start seeing like her, her, her history and her background. Like, she, she really feels a way about like her, uh, I forget, Alicia Lur, however, whatever, however it's, uh, it's called. And that's a real problem for her, which is, which is which is understandable. You know what I'm saying? Because like, hey, she just fall down and, and titties popping out of ass everywhere. You know, so you gotta understand it. You know what I mean? Um, but like, she had to get over that. She had to also get over like how it made her feel. You know, growing up in high school, it's like she always had the strength, but it was just like it's just like a mental block, and she had to get that out of the way. And then now, once we see those forms with her now, and like she's going against these two. Girls who like they look like freaking cat demons, you know what I mean? Like they were cold, you know. In a fight, I don't think she beats them at all. But like just in the super game tag, you know, she she was able to get the upper hand and beat them because like she was able to unlock or well, get rid of that mental block that she had. So now we going now I, I don't know if she's going to train with Shira and um and uh, Arthur to like you know further uncover like a next level of strength because they, they, I mean the fact of the matter is they need it. this entire season they have like needed help to in order to to win battles that's one of the things I really enjoyed about this season they they lost but they lost in a way where it's like okay this loss how they lost made sense and like they didn't get no crazy power to just like that came out of nowhere the stuff with Shinra. Uh, Ogan wasn't able to like defeat the uh, the the devil that he what's it called the demon the demon that he had fought, but he was able to hold it off. You know what I'm saying? Tashima was able to like get you know the grace of um, the, uh, 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 the the evangelist, and then he was able to take it out. 
as well as like other times where Shinra fought Caron and like he couldn't beat him. And the only reason Shinra got away from Caron is because I gave it just time to go because they grabbed Inca, okay? It's like so many different times this season where they, they just typically lose. Uh, um, uh, uh, one of the lieutenants got the head took off. Um, Juggernaut lost an arm and a leg. Like it's so many different times. Like, even thinking back to when Tommy Q was getting ready to like, hey, I'm going to defend him. And like, you all, you know how that is in like in the anime. When somebody think, like, oh, they're going to defend him. You know, they managed to put up a fight more than what you think they're capable of doing. That's what happened with her. She got knee in the stomach and was about to be killed. So I enjoy, I've enjoyed everything this season had to offer so thus far. Um, I think it's only one episode left. Or is it the one episode or three episodes left? I have to uh, look and make sure. But like I, I, I thought this episode was good. It's, it's pushing the story forward. And it just really makes you ready for season three. Just because it's like, man, there's still so much stuff to be done. Because we're still looking for pillars. Uh, we still not reach. We still aren't clear on things. And they still aren't, in all honesty, they aren't ready for the white clad. And I think there's still people working inside. Um... The, the fire force that uh, that are working with like the white class so there's no telling where this thing's about to go I, I'm enjoying it so far uh, you guys let me know what you thought about this episode down in the comments hit that like button subscribe to my channel thanks for watching the video hope you guys stand safe and I'll catch up with you guys later peace